if you feel broken, depressed, sad, like you just want to give up. Because no matter what you do, you just can't seem to progress. And you've tried everything, you've looked up all the advice on the internet, and nothing works. Just know that there's only one thing you can do. And that's take action, do something. Because the only thing you can do in this world that leads to results is to take action. You know, when I started college, I remember they gave us this book. This was a long time ago. It was like a little planner. It had uh, like a calendar and you could fill in little things under the dates. You know, a planner, like an actual physical planner. And they probably still give these away, I don't know. And on the back of the planner, it said to not dwell on the past. And that's the first time I ever read that. And I thought, wow, that's, that's an interesting statement. Don't dwell on the past. And that statement impacted my life in tremendous ways. So now I'm here to tell you that same message. Don't dwell on your past mistakes, on your past failures. Don't dwell on it because it does nothing for you. And don't worry about the future. Worrying about the future also does nothing for you. The only thing you can do to improve your life, to get better at math, to get in shape, to get that job you want, the only thing you can do is be in the present. Because in the present, that's the only place you can take action. And, and this is such a powerful idea, but it's also a very simple idea. The idea that you have to be in the present to take action. And action is the only thing you can do in this world that's going to lead to results. It's, it's that simple. It really is that simple. And when you realize that, you realize that action is the solution to all of your problems. You know, it, it's, it's such a big deal that I wrote a book on it. My first book, Real Superpowers That Will Change Your Life, is based on this, whole, this, on this premise of how action is the one thing that you can do to change your life. And the book has more stuff in it and it helps you find your big dream. And it gives you these superpowers that you can follow. And they're all based on getting you to take action. Because you taking action... Is, is the one thing you can do in this world that's going to help you. If, you. if you want to learn mathematics, what do you have to do? You have to do mathematics. If you want to get in shape, what do you have to do? You have to eat right, go to the gym, exercise, run. If you want to get a better job, you have to apply. You know, if, if, if you want to date that pretty girl, you have to ask her, you know, whatever it is you're trying to do in life, you, you have to take those chances. You have to act. And so if you're sitting here thinking, well, my life sucks. I, I don't know what to do. You know, I don't know what the right choice is. 
Well, you don't have to know. That, that's the beauty of it because nobody knows, right? Nobody knows the right choice. Nobody has all the answers. Nobody knows. Nobody knows the future. But you do know one thing. You do know that in order to initiate any type of change in your life, you have to take action. And so when you're feeling stuck on things, just, just take a small action, something simple. Like if, let's say you're trying to learn math and you're just, sit down and pick up a pencil. Actually, I have one right here. Pick up a pencil and a piece of paper and do some mathematics. Do one problem, take action. Just, just one problem. You don't have to, don't commit to more than that. Just commit to one. You know, a lot of times when you do a problem, it gets you going and you want to do more. It's like like when you don't want to go for a run and you start running after about 10 minutes, you kind of start to get into it. It's like, oh, this is fun. And you want to keep going, you know? Or when you go to the gym, you start working out, you know, it's like, oh, this is, you don't want to go. But once you get there, you think differently. So a lot of it's about being self-aware and realizing that once you start, you're going to feel differently. And when you build that self-awareness, it takes practice, it gets you to take action. And that, that, that ability, you know, once you start, how you can keep going, I call that momentum mastery. It's in my book as well. It's powerful. It's powerful. There's, there's a lot of stuff related to this, all, all kinds of stuff flow state it's all, all, all kinds of interesting things different ways that human beings work and it's all centered around though taking action so if you're stuck know you're not alone and know that the solution is just doing something doing something you know i get a lot of emails from people all over the world every day i get a few emails, sometimes several. And you can contact me. You can send me messages. And um, from my website, mathsorcerer.com or freemathbids.com, my courses are there too. But when you go to that website, click contact. And that's, that's the best way to uh, send me a message. But people have all kinds of problems. I get all kinds of messages. But the solution to all of them is action. Of course, the hard part is, you know, what, what do you do? What action do you take? Well, that depends on your circumstance. But just know that even one small step is better than no steps, right? Just take a little step towards your goals. One math problem. Just get started, my friends. Anyways, that's all I wanted to say in this video. Check out my courses, same website, mathsorcerer.com, books in the description. As always, stay strong, my friends.